Hello guys and welcome to another video with Cass on the Mizuma channel. Today's video I want to talk about the Egg Festival. So for the first part of the video I will show you uh, what pretty much everybody wants to know which is how to win uh, at the Egg Hunt competition. And for the second part of the video I'll be showing you guys some really cool stuff that hopefully you have never seen anywhere else. So the first little trick that I want to teach you guys is if it's your first time you need to go to the shop and reserve some money to buy strawberry seeds. You can only buy those during this festival, in the beginning of the game at least. So take the opportunity to, to buy those and plant those as soon as possible so you can get some good money. Also, in case you're new to the game, for every festival you need to talk to the mayor in order to start any events uh, that are going to happen. So uh, let's start talking about the egg hunt. Uh, spoiler alert, every year Abigail wins the festival. So uh, it's basically a competition against her. So uh, let's go through the dialogues and I will show you guys a very easy path that you can that you can try to remember. It's easy to remember. It doesn't have a lot of obstacles for you to get stuck, but you have to be smart about your move. So let's do it. So start by going all the way down, get to this corner and there is an egg here at this corner. Then on the very corner of the map, there is another one. Some of those are really hard to see. Try not to get stuck on this bush down there. Uh, it's really a source of getting stuck. There's another one on this corner. The next one is really hard to see. It's by the corner of this fence. So now you can see that we already have four. And if you go uh, on this fence, there's another one around here. And if you go to the next corner inside the fence here, you can find another one really well hidden. And now we have six. We need a total of nine in order to win the festival so there's another one here so that makes it seven uh try to not get stuck on the carpet or the tables there is one by the trash can in here uh, next to the tree and finally there's another one next to the other tree so we have a total of nine eggs which is enough to beat abigail and we basically win now so let's collect the prize okay the mayor will get everyone together and yeah <laughs> make a little bit of drama and then you know the winner of this year's egg hunt is and yeah this is the name of my player and i won so this time here's your prize enjoy and he gives me 1000 gold guys so what's going on here the first time you beat the competition what you get is actually this straw hat this is what you're gonna get as a prize for the competition this only happens on the, the first time that you beat abigail uh, all the following times that you are able to beat the competition you are going to get 1000 gold this is how the festival works guys so uh, I will try now to restart the day and then I will go back to the festival and then I will show you guys all the other stuff that I was talking about all right people so I just restarted the day so let's get started by myth busting this thing so some people believe that if you drink coffee you can basically use your speed buff uh, inside the festival which is not really true guys as you can see I'm not walking fast already <laughs> and this is going to be the same during the entire festival. I think during festivals, uh, all your buffs basically get reset or stopped. As I mentioned before, uh, if we don't stop Abigail, she will win every year, guys. So my first idea was to actually follow Abigail. Maybe she's going to do a specific path in that makes sense. And if we follow Abigail's exact path, this is the optimal path and basically we're going to win if we just follow her. Well, <laughs> apparently the devs thought about everything. As you can see here, the player is a lot faster than any of the NPCs, as you can see <laughs> in here. Oh, we can actually we can actually get in the way. Let's see. We can get in the way, guys. Look at this. <laughs> This is weird, but don't worry guys, uh, as you can see, she actually never touches the eggs. She goes to some locations where uh, you can actually see some eggs, but because they are so slow, they're never going to be able to get all the eggs and she's going to basically be stranded in this region uh, where she cannot get all the eggs. Basically, she, she has access to this one, this other one, and the other one on the corner, this one on the fence, and the other one uh, right above here, which is not enough to win. Uh, the competition so uh, as you guys notice i also stopped the time the timer i had to use a little trick in order to be able to show you guys what's going on on the map so let's see some other cool stuff some eggs are unreachable guys as, as you can see those two eggs are outside of the region where uh, the limits for the area where you can go inside the game 
uh, allow you to go. So some people think that those eggs, uh, th those particular eggs are unreachable, but they are not. All you have to do is to go around Pierre's shop and there you are guys, you can't get those eggs. But it doesn't mean that we don't have unreachable eggs. There's a total of 27 eggs, so let me show you guys where all of those are. So we already have 11 eggs from the ones I showed you guys. So there is another one next to these uh, bushes. And next to these bushes, also outside of the cemetery, we have another egg by this tree. Uh, also next to the cemetery, we have yet another egg. If you go inside the cemetery, you can find one egg here and another one behind the tombstone. Uh, yeah, <laughs> be careful not to click on it or, or else you're going to waste your time. There is another egg around here uh, by, the, by the sewer, by the, by the fences uh, with the sewer. Another one by this tree, this, is, this one is pretty visible. And there's one on the bridge, uh, so out of, outside of the bridge we can also find Vincent. <laughs> and by this bush we have another one. This one is very much hidden, but we can still see it, it's there. Uh, so we have a total of 21. And if we go here by this bush, there's yet another one. Go around Lewis truck, and there is one egg inside Lewis truck. I think this one is really unreachable, guys. It's impossible to get this one. So if I click on it, I get this message. It's just the back of Lewis old pickup truck. So uh, I haven't been able to get this egg with all of my tests. So if you guys know how to get to this egg, please leave me um, uh, a comment in the comment section. So there is this one. Uh, that you can go around and there is yet another one by Pam's trailer right here on your way back from Pam's trailer you can pick up this other one I forgot to mention this one and as I mentioned before uh, the 27th one is inside this guy's truck which I think is impossible to get so yeah, I think that's all that I wanted to tell you guys about the Egg Festival. So if you liked the video, please click the like button. And I hope to see you soon again, guys. Bye.